Hello and welcome to this promotional video for the 3D Environment Design course with CG Society. My name is Paul McWilliams and I have five and a half years experience working in visual effects. The film productions I have worked on during that time include Inception, Harry Potter and the Deathly Hallows Part 2, The Chronicles of Narnia Prince Caspian and Sweeney Todd. During this eight week mentored course you'll learn how to create a production ready building to the same standard as the work I created whilst working in film post-production environment. Details for the course are as follows. In week one, you'll learn about removing lens distortion and how to use Autodesk's Image Modeler to create a 3D point cloud and camera line. In week two, you'll be introduced to the image modeling workflow in Maya and produce an initial model lineup proving the 3D solve from Image Modeler works. In week three, the focus will be on modeling the house and its details. You'll also produce an occlusion render. In week four, you'll learn about UV mapping and I'll explain all the tips and tricks I know to speed up this part of the workflow. In week five, the texturing process begins by lining up and prepping an image for projection. You'll learn about creating a shader setup that handles multiple productions in Maya, as well as being introduced to Autodesk Mudbox toolset for 3D painting. In week six, texturing continues using a combination of projections and traditional texturing in the 2D space within Photoshop. You'll see how to incorporate 3D painting with Mudbox into the workflow. This week you'll also learn about methods for adding dirt textures. In week 7, with the textured house complete, you'll learn how to create a displacement map as well as a bump map. Displacement look development will occur using Mental Ray and its subdivision approximation. In week 8, the whole course is brought together. You'll, you'll look, develop the house's shaders, set up the scene for lighting in mental ray with final gather and learn how to light the scene against a background plate. Finally, you'll be walked through how to render out separated EXRs or TIFFs and composite it all together in the foundry's new. Here are some final rendered images of the house used for training. The next course starts on the 17th of September 2012. Thank you for watching and I hope to see you on the next course.